hello you guys what is up and welcome back to another video today is just gonna be a little vloggy vlog um i'm gonna show you guys how to make that salmon because i finally got my salmon you guys this is why you don't sleep on aldi because i just got the salmon like the same salmon that hgb was selling for like 15 dollars. i got it for seven i literally love aldi so much okay i want to show you guys what i got from from typo really fast if you guys don't have a typo by you it's literally like my favorite store ever because because i'm such a nerd and i love like stationery and stuff like that but first of all look how cool this bag is i love that i love that so much okay so really fast i'm just going to show you what i got me and my boyfriend they had notebooks buy one get one half off so we got i got this one for my new for the new year for my budgeting last year i used the cheeto one or the one with the cheetahs on it or something but this is the same exact one i love how small it is and i like how it's flimsy so i got this and it says choose optimism so that one's cute so i got that and then my boyfriend got this one so yeah those are super cute and they were only five dollars so half off of one of those and then all their Christmas stuff was only a dollar. <laughs> it was like on sale. These were originally $11.99. These are um, little Christmas cards, mixed Christmas card pack, 20 cards. And they're elf themed. I love these so much. They were only $1. And then we got two of these. These are the last things. We got two of these sticker rolls. But they say like to and from and they're like so funny so we got two of these so now we have 48 of these so i think i want to open them i haven't seen them oh my god i love these they're like little to and from stickers these are adorable omg santa okay so those are so cute and they're only a dollar originally five dollars so not as big of savings as the other ones all right now we're gonna go to the kitchen and i'm gonna show you guys how to make the salmon it's so good okay bye okay so really fast i'm gonna show you what i got from all these so here we go for fourteen dollars i got that everything in one here thing of salmon. this would have been one thing of salmon at hgb legit 14.79 okay here's what i got i got my salmon this is the same exact piece that was at heb and the crappy ass pieces i saw at kroger this guy for $7.73. So that's gonna be our little lunch before work. I got spinach. I got trail mix. I got my favorite turkey bacon ever. This is the best turkey bacon you can buy. And then one more bag of lettuce. So I feel like that's pretty good. And then with the salmon, I'm gonna make this broccoli. Not all of it, just one of these. I bought this from Walmart the other day. And then this head of, of what is this? Of cauliflower that my aunt and uncle grew in their garden. Kelly, if you're watching this, shout out to you. Hopefully this is still good. Oh yeah, this is probably still good. Oh my God, this thing is freaking big. Kelly, this is insane. Look how big this is. <laughs> when I hold this up, holy moly, that's a big head of cauliflower. Look at that. Look at that leafy green, straight from the garden, homegrown. That's beautiful. Okay, so we're gonna cook that up with our salmon. So I'm gonna show you guys the key ingredients for the salmon, okay? Okay, so this is all you need for the salmon. So you're gonna need soy sauce. I try to get low sodium, but this one is not. We've just had this forever, so. Soy sauce, you're gonna need, this is the second key, Dijon mustard. I know this sounds really weird, but just stick with me. And then you're gonna need some garlic. This is like a garlic, onion, and Italian herbs combo little thing, but I just normally just get the minced garlic, but this will do. Okay, so you're gonna need a little ramekin, something like this to mix. And you're just gonna wanna, I just eyeball it. I don't know, so we're gonna mix this up. All right, so basically you're just gonna squirt some Dijon mustard in here, a good amount because you're gonna wanna coat the salmon. Okay, I got like this much. 
And then you're gonna wanna just add some soy sauce. Not too much, probably, I feel like that, that's a lot, but I put a lot of mustard. Okay, now we're just gonna mix this up. And you want it to be kind of just like, I put too much soy sauce. Well, no, it's fine. Kind of just like a light brown, like creamy color, kind of like this. And then you're just gonna put the garlic in here, this much. And we're gonna put that into the mixture here. And we're just gonna mix that up. Okay, so I'm about to open the salmon. Here we go. I'm gonna put it right here on the plate. And I don't know if you're supposed to wash it off, but I like to wash it off because I don't know, it's like sitting in juices. So I'm gonna go wash it off, hold on. Okay, there we go, our salmon. And I'll probably just cut this in half and we're gonna do like half and half for each one. Now what you're gonna, gonna wanna do is take your mixture, looks like this, and we're just gonna put it all over it. What I like to do is finish it with a little bit of like a little bit of garlic powder, a little bit of pepper. Get some pepper action up in here. Okay, that's it. Except I forgot to preset my oven, so let's do that. And I'm gonna go ahead and put this in the oven and then I'm gonna chop the veggies. And typically I like to steam the veggies, so I guess you could put them in here with the salmon while it's cooking, but I don't know, I like steamed veggies a little better, so I'm gonna stick that in there. Okay, I forgot, this is how much I saved. This is even maybe a little too much, but I saved a little bit to finish it off um, whenever it comes out or whenever it's almost done, so. What is up and welcome back to another day. I decided I'm just going to continue this vlog on and just combine some days because I didn't really end up doing much um, on the last part of this. So what I have planned for today, I just dropped off some packages at the post office. So I have those. I sold one thing on Poshmark and then I also shipped out my giveaway prize. I shipped out the stickers. So um, that is going out. I, um, I threw in a couple extra things though. So. Okay. I hope you like those. Okay. Um, <clears throat> and then I shipped out two orders that I had. So I did that quickly and then I just went to, I'm bad guys. I'm literally so bad. I just went to McDonald's and I got a drink because I have some more errands to run and I have my sleeve. Of course they have these like new clear cups. I think they're still left over from the holidays because they have like little snowflakes and stuff. Um, but I got a Coke and I put it in my Ronald McDonald sleeve. These I think were limited edition if you guys saw when I got it. Um, I had it in my cash stuffing video but these were like $5 and they donated to the Ronald McDonald house which I fully support. Um, because we did have to stay there 
at a point in my life when my sister got into her accident. So, I love that. Okay, so what else do I have to do today? I have to go to the bank and then I need to get my car washed and I need to vacuum it out because it's really not in a good state right now. Um, and then there's something else. Oh, I need to pick up my prescription. So, okay, we're gonna go do that. Okay, you guys, hi. So I just kind of ran most of the errands. You guys, I just love CVS, I mean Walgreens, okay? I just love Walgreens. I came here earlier and then, then I hurried up. I turned around and left because the line was so freaking long. I went to the bank. Now I just came back to Walgreens. The line was short, so I was the first car. You guys, so when I pulled up, I pulled up to the second lane because it said COVID testing lane by the window or prescription either lane. So I went to the either lanes because I was picking up my prescription. So I went to the second lane and um, I'm sitting there for a really long time and the car next to me is sitting there too. And then like two or three cars come up behind her and then like two or three cars come up behind me and I'm still sitting there for a long time. I'm just waiting, waiting, waiting. And then I like press the help button because I was like, oh, maybe like, maybe they like there's no buzzer that like alerts them that someone's in the lane so i just press the help button i'll insert the picture because i'm just like sitting i'm there's just like a little button so i press the help button and not nobody says anything so i'm like okay like let me just wait some more the next thing i know the lady i hear the lady next to me tell the girl at the window she says you need to help the cars behind me because they've been here way longer than her and she points at me. I'm seeing, I'm watching and I hear her. And then she looks at me like this and then drives away. I'm like, what the hell? So then she helps the two cars behind her that got there after me. She helps them and then finally helps me. And I'm just like, what? I'm just like, what is wrong with people? Like. I was so confused. And why did you look at me like that and then drive away? I have no idea. But then she had such issues finding my prescription. And then she asked me to verify like my whole identity. And I'm like, for nobody's ever asked me to do this. Oh my God, what a weird Walgreens experience. Okay, anyways, I'm gonna head back to probably my side of town because I had to drive over here. And I'm gonna go get my car wash and then I'm gonna go home and film and make lunch and just be at home because that interaction was too much for me. And I just spent like 30 minutes sitting on Walgreens cause so <laughs> I'm over that. So I'm about to go get my car wash. up at the car wash i'm so hot i regret wearing this jacket 
but I couldn't really take it off because my shirt's like really cropped so I didn't want to cause a scene so whoo my car is so much better you guys this middle area alone is like a thousand times better I don't know if you could really tell how bad it was on the camera but this is so much better and then um, I have some stuff back there that I need to take inside whenever I get home so I'm gonna get on the road and I'm gonna go home now Okay, you guys, it is time for us to finish up the advent calendar. I know it's already January, but we, this is the final three days. So I know all of you guys wanted a ring in the last one, but I, I already know it's not going to happen. It's this. I'm not sure what this is, but this is number 23 or 24. I don't even know. Oh my God. <laughs> All right, so this is actually really freaking cute. It's a chip clip for chip bags, and I, he knows that I love chips. <laughs> this is actually really freaking cute, and it looks like it's a strong, like, heavy-duty clip. It says, no bad snacks, and it's big. Oh, my God, this is a good thing. Okay, so that's the first thing. Okay, next. It was kind of coming undone. Um, okay, I think this is the same thing, but different. <laughs> so these are also chip clips. Let me see how these work. Okay, so it looks like you just put them on like this. They're like little sharks, it looks like. Or some type of fish. These are hilarious. So you just put it right on the chip bag like that. Okay, so I got some chip clips. Okay, last day, guys. This is the finale of our advent calendar, finally coming to a close. It was tied and hung like this. Strange little apparatus here. And we have, okay, I can use this for my desk. This is, it says home sweet office. And then, oh my God, wait, this is actually really cool. Hold on. Okay, so it's a notepad and you do it every day. So it says, what day is it? You can write the date or it says, I have no idea or doesn't matter. That's funny. It says, um, goals for today, totally fine to leave blank. And you have three main goals for the day. <laughs> oh my God. Wait, these are funny. Okay, so it says today's accomplishments. It says showered before noon, showered at all, wore real clothes, applied to an email, replied to an email, actually did my hair, moved from the couch, signed on before 10 a.m., attended a virtual meeting, turned my webcam on, no alcohol in my coffee. That's hilarious. And then it says snack planner, morning, mid-morning, pre-lunch, post-lunch, afternoon, 3 p.m. crash, late afternoon, and dessert. And then it has for tomorrow. Okay, that's really funny and really cute. So, yay. Okay, so guys, that is going to wrap up the advent calendar for Savmas. I'm sorry that I extended it like another month, but I don't know why. I just didn't finish it. So, shout out to my boyfriend for filling that. He did a great job. All of you guys gave him supportive comments. Every time you guys would leave him a comment, I read it to him and he thought it was funny. So, and he was like, see, I did buy good stuff. I'm like, okay, y'all made, okay. Anyways, all right, so yeah, that was a really fun little advent calendar. So I love that so much. I probably will do it again next year. Um, so yeah, okay, now I'm gonna go make some lunch and then I'm probably just gonna work on my Etsy and then I'll probably close the vlog because I'm not doing anything else. Stella is whining, hold on. Bubba. Can I say hi, girl? You say hi? Hi. She needs to be groomed. <gasps> Baba. You say hi? Say hi. She's a good girl. <laughs> oh, my Baba. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys my favorite thing. 
to eat for lunch. It's tacos, deconstructed tacos. I um, get my shells and I put them in the, to in the um, air fryer and I toast them and then I split them and I make like four halves and I like build a taco like that and I just eat it like a little chip, not like a taco. So I'll show you that. I'm thinking I'm gonna have that. And yeah, so 